Hey everyone, this is Lucky70x, welcome back to Let's Play Jay Cocoon 2. In the last episode, we finished up the Earth Forest, well, at least the first one, and we took another advanced test, which means in this episode we get a new Divine Beast, we're going to be able to do our first merging, and uh, we're going to start Fire Spy, where we actually have a quest already to get a, a thing to get a Fire Egg, which is pretty cool, a Drac Egg, so not bad. We're going to start Fire Spy. Uh, as usual, we're going to get that Divine Beast that um, is always early in this these early Elemental Forests. And then we will uh, hatch it and actually add it to our party right away. So that's pretty cool. Fire Spy commence. There's a guy right here. Can't really get around you, so I might as well fight you. Uh, we've seen these guys before, but they're, they're, they're just your basic attackers of uh, the thing. So hopefully we can blind it just to prevent a little bit of damage. We can, because ceiling is a boss. As what he does, he blinds things like it's nobody's business. So we're just going to go ahead and... Get Scooter a turn in here to make sure Scooter gets some EXP, and then we can uh, go ahead and go into Tamal and finish this guy off in a couple turns. He's still blinded for one more turn, which means uh, this fire move he's probably going to be using right now is not, or just a normal attack, I guess, but it misses regardless. He can see again, but it's too late, because he's going to die. Boom! So, that's pretty cool. Um, that takes care of that. Get some extra experience. Hopefully Tamal is going to be leveling up soon because I uh, could definitely use him at a slightly higher... Or I want to get him to level 17 before I merge him. I am going to merge him earlier than 20 for reasons. Uh, you'll see pretty... They'll, they'll be pretty obvious. Basically, I'm going to be using him as a corner between fire and wind, in case you couldn't really guess by now. So it'll be pretty cool. Uh, I'm just going to let Tamal go in here first because it doesn't really matter. These uh, mages... You can see, this is where we're going to be in our egg, by the way. So we're going to be in this little cute... This, this cute little thing. It's so it's like a warthog bunny. It's awesome. I love this thing. I guess it's more of a warthog than a bunny, but whatever. Um, I'm just gonna let Scooter heal before anything else. But yeah, we're gonna be in one of these. Um, gonna sort of be my main magic user of the. Well, I, I guess not the main one, but or well, not the only one, but probably one of my uh, well, one of the more important magic users of my team that I have in mind. Uh, assume I don't change anything up, but it's pretty awesome. I like it, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, get it and go from there. I don't know, just my plan. And Tamal does level up. That's good. Level 17. Uh, loses on a few levels, but it's worth it for the trade-off that's gonna be. Really, it's it's a hard thing to decide when to merge. That's definitely one of the harder things in this game. But now that we have the egg, uh, as usual, we'll go back to the temple and we'll. We're going to do some merging and some hatching and all this kind of cool stuff. I'm excited. That's going to be kind of awesome. Uh, finally get to show off the merging. It's only seven episodes in. That's not too bad, I guess. Maybe. I don't know. Uh, one thing I quickly want to do is quickly over Jamal. Uh, here's his stats now. We're going to compare his stats before and after merging. Just to, uh, as a demonstration. So you can kind of see what they are now. What's his HP and MP at? Okay. So note, just note all that, I guess, because... Uh, I, it's, I, I actually am curious to see this too. I haven't really directly ever compared before and after uh, merging because the thing is it resets him back to level one. He keeps all of his stats, but he does go back down to his uh, baby form. So he gets rid of his evolution, which is a big deal because that actually does affect his stats a bit. So I'm kind of curious to see how much it's going to impact it. Anyways, we're going to do the merge first. So we're going to merge them all. Uh, and we're going to merge it with a wind beast here. I mean, I could do it with one of these and just get a better fire hit but that doesn't really I don't want to do that I want to go ahead and get something that can go in the corner here uh, lots of options um, good abilities this is, confuse is actually a really good status but unfortunately the ability is not that good what's nice though is this one because it has a good ability strength up, up one is great for Tamal and uh, poison cloud poison is a very good set is a very good status effect to have especially early game um, really useful against some bosses so getting a blind and poison going on it's a pretty potent combination so here we go, our very first merge. Uh, it forms a new egg. We can then immediately go ahead and hatch the egg and get our... Uh, we, the merger has created a tamal. I have created tamal! And then it hatches again. We've seen these hatch hatchings before, so we don't need to see them again. Uh, so we're going to put tamal on the corner now, because as you can see, he has a fire and a wind move, so he can now attack on both. Yeah, his fire move is going to be a little weaker, but his wind move will be a lot stronger, so that's cool. Anyway, let's hatch our new divine beast as well. Um, I guess I'll just show off this full animation, just for this new one. I don't know. Why not? We get ourselves one of these things. I don't know. I like these things. They're kind of they're, they're they're cool. Um, so there we go. 
our new divine beast right here. We're going to name it after a good friend of mine, another elf here, a uh, little foo. So you're going to be sort of my mage, I guess. Pretty cool. So there we go. Going to put you right front and center of the fire formation. And uh, now we have everything start taken care of. Uh, those other beasts I have will be training in the background. They'll join my team eventually. I just want to have this sort of double fire, double wind combination early, because having that kind of combination going is really potent. So uh, we can compare it to all stats now. As you can see, his stats have gone down. Not by that much, but like, you know, about four or five, six, seven or so. Except strength, obviously, because I have that t uh, plus ten strength boost, so obviously it's gone up. As you can see, the evolution has gone up as well. Not by much, it's only gone up by one. The reason being, um, how it works is you can see that there's like an evolution number for the comma. Your evolution points will go up um, that much. Minus one if it's a different element, so because it was a different element, you only got one instead of two. And uh, it'll also go up plus... Uh, one or two depending on what kind of uh, if it's the same like gener general species will go up by one if it's the exact same species it will go up by two so merging up the same thing is very good it's something actually Tamal doesn't really have an option to do though because you don't really get any mouse to merge with until late game so his evolution is going to be really slow that's why, another reason why I'm merging him early because he's going to need more merges to reach his final form which is kind of annoying but who cares we have ourselves a combination of four now it's pretty awesome Let's go ahead and take on Fire Spy now that we're like seven minutes into the video. I can still hopefully get through at least one or two of these in this episode. That would be pretty cool. So let's head in this direction this time. And well, is there anything up here worthwhile? Is there anything else new, new in this little thing now that this is gone? No, it's just empty. Cool. Cool story, bro. Cool bro story. Let's go ahead and into this door and see what we can find. We can find ourselves a protect book. Raises your defense. Don't really care. Probably gonna get rid of it, cause, cause it's the thing. Um, I guess it's the only thing left here. So, story time. I guess. Hello, hello. There's two of you. Hey, what are you guys doing in such a place? <laughs> Strongest divine beast quiz. These are Og beast hunters. They're pretty cool. What are the strongest divine beasts in the world? You might be biased. Or actually, no, they're, they're Chew. That's right, they're Chew trainers. Whatever. Um, well, they're definitely Chews, so. I bet it's Chews. I bet it? Yeah, I yeah. <laughs> Chews are the best. These guys are funny. Yeah. So they're, they'll actually be important for these two. These two guys are actually going to be uh, very important to our storyline. But I actually don't really get an introduction to uh, any major non-masked characters right now. So the fire story takes a while to get going, but they'll be important later. You'll see. You'll see. You will see. So let's just head on to the next fire forest. That actually was pretty darn quick, but I'm okay with that. I don't mind short little forests. That the first ones in, in, in area are always pretty tiny overall. So, uh, this looks like just one giant long path. It's pretty exciting. Yo there, I'm one of the coup guys. You use coups too? They remind me of the sniper from TF2. So I'm interested. You a coup fan, sir? You think you know the mask by now, Kahu? This mask no shield, it's the sign of a coup beast hunter. We, ha we just got a coup. Little Foo is a coup. <laughs> and good at defense. They're good at magic, too. Absolutely perfect. There's no more to say. The certain one I have is really good at magic. Like, you'll see its magic stats ridiculous, though. Anyway, we actually get a thing to boost. Uh, a coup. So we can boost a little Foo. This is gonna be kind of all sorts of rhymey. That's kind of funny. Uh... I guess shoes and Ogs are the same thing. Huh. Whatever. I think they are. I think there's like some sort of... I don't know. The whole Chew Og... I'm pretty sure they're the same species and they just like are called two different things. Maybe I'm just weird. Anyway, so uh, as you can see, those things boost uh, Little Foo's magic stat, which is good. Because Little Foo is going to be a ridiculously good mage at some point. And that's my plan. That is the plan. And hopefully it'll go well. So uh, first battle for our new team. Let's just go ahead and, uh, we'll go ahead and go on this side, I guess, for starters. Are we just gonna, we're just, just gonna kill it one go. Well, those things are pretty weak at defense, as you can see. Oh, well. 
uh, get some levels. As you can see, it's a lot easier to quick get experience once you've uh, merged again, so Tamal's going to be getting experience. Not as fast as a uh, little Fu will, because he has a merge under his belt. But he'll get, he'll rack up the, uh, the levels pretty quickly, and it'll be pretty cool. So, there's that, I suppose. There's a guy here, I guess we're gonna have to fight him because he's in the way of a thing I want to go into. We actually got initiative out of that, out of all that. Um, I'm kind of sitting here like, how am I gonna go about, like, fighting now without well, making sure everyone gets experience? Because I'm actually, like, able to kill, I, like, I don't know if this is gonna kill, maybe, like, my fire side is now the slightly weaker side because I have a level E move. But tomorrow, as you can see, hits hard now. Uh, Fu's not gonna hit hard to start with, but... Jeez, I can't even, like, I can't catch a break here, apparently. Apparently, I'm just gonna get experience no matter what. Whatever. Level... Uh, two levels! Nice! Uh, as you're gonna see, you're gonna see little Fu's gonna catch up pretty fast. Um, it doesn't take a while for all the experiences to even out in the end. But, story time number two! There's an old guy! Hello! I like this guy. Hey, sir! What are you doing here? Actually, it's kind of funny. <laughs> well, if it isn't a tiny beast hunter, I'm taking I'm not rest. that tiny. Anyway, this guy's name's Wu, which is funny because we got a coup named Little Fu in an episode of Wu. Did the divine beasts get you? With Kahu. <laughs> All sorts of Wu sounds. If I don't go meddling in their affairs, they won't bother me. So this is, yeah, but Wu, very That's strong beast level? hunter. Um, huh? Then are you a beast hunter, sir? He, he's pretty awesome. You can say that, but he's sort of your wise old guy that kicks everyone's ass sort of thing. What? Oh, this tail? I got cursed when a fairy cocoon took Are you going to want me to keep my tail, too? That's terrible. You're making it sound like it's all my fault. It kind of is. Serves you right. <laughs> At this rate, you're going to turn into a beast. Meanie. No way, never. I asked Levant, and he told me to collect the forest orbs. Forest orbs? You mean the ones once given to the chosen one? He <laughs> has such a high pitched little old man voice. My name's Kahu. What's your name? His name's Wu. He's my rival. Meet hey, old Nam. Man. I'm never gonna let you get away with it today. He has a sort of rivalry with this old man. <laughs> Just as usual. You don't motivate me at all. I do not fight the weak. Who you calling weak? Try saying that after we fight. See, Nam's a little headstrong and uh, arrogant and wants to fight everyone. But uh, Wu regards him as weak. Having an argument? <laughs> Do not worry. I beat him once, and now he's always like this. He is quite able, but he relies on brute force alone. One of those types. But wait. Right, Nam? No matter how strong you get, you cannot get the orbs. Hey, hey, we said we need the orbs. Don't know about them. What's that? The hey. Stones of ordeal. Woo, what are you doing? In the forest. Woo, stop. Do no. <laughs> how provincial. This boy knows. I what a difference. Pitting Nam well, against me. I am to fight. I might as well fight with one strong enough to get the orbs. So he sort of is encouraging Nam to go after the orbs, and thus makes hey, he sort of tricks Nam into becoming our rival. I'll just go get him. Then we fight, okay? <sighs> Why you gotta make our lives difficult, Wu? Why you gotta be like that? Why you gotta be like that? As it happens, as it always happens, Kahu entered a stifling, burning hot forest in pursuit of the orb. Until meeting the funny-looking old man and having a chat, you thought, what an easy victory. But then, that old man is extraordinarily cunning. And before you know it, he's in competition for the orb with a simple little boy. Kahu, you succeeded in walking right into it. You call this exciting? I can't believe it. Anyways, so yeah, we're now stuck in a rivalry with Nam to get the orbs because Wu is a jerk. Wu, you're terrible. You knew that I'm looking for them. You tell him, Kahu. <laughs> Sorry, but I had to say that, or Nam would not back down. Satisfied, Kahu? Now this crazy old man's got you involved. So you get for being friendly, Kahu, and telling me your story. But it is sort of exciting. Like, I got a rival. You know what would be all better? 
if you can get the orbs for free and not die. Go ahead and ask me about anything you like. Okay. Okay. Then then you just stop the conversation. Whatever. You know what? I've done a few woo. I'm not even mad. I am not even mad. Actually, I'm furious. I am goddamn furious, woo. You are how there's a guy in the way. Blur. Well, fine. Well, fine. I'll fight you. Jeez. Okay, it turns out if I don't get a crit, I can actually do this in such a way where I li he lives and I can actually experience with everyone. That's pretty awesome. Jeez, it's like if I'm just a little. But if I, I love, start leveling up more, it's not gonna be able to do that anymore. Which is gonna be kind of sad. I need stronger enemies, darn it. Whatever. I uh, probably cut like 10 seconds out there. But you know what? Whatever. Because level, level 2 is getting to level 5. So you can see leveling much faster than Tamal is. Even uh, not getting that experience early on. So that's good. That means uh, little Fu will evolve soon enough. And we can actually have her be a bit stronger. And uh, able to compete with the team. The newer Divine Beasts. Well actually because I'm raising a bunch on the side. They won't be super weak. But when I add them team to the team. But the ones who are on the main team. Will always be the stronger core of the, of the team, overall team. There's a new guy over here. I'm going to go ahead and fight him. We've seen this kind of guy before. He does that area attack thing so he can hurt everyone. Which is kind of annoying. I don't know if he's going to be able to survive these attacks or not. Uh, I can heal anyway. So you know what? I mean, he can probably live these two. I'm really like, I'm really nervous going into my wind side now. Because it's so powerful. In comparison. This is powerful enough to kill him anyway. So. <laughs> it's, it's a tough journey I guess. Trying to get all my experience spread out properly. Because I keep killing things really fast now. As you can see, doubling it up makes it much more potent and powerful. So, there's that, I guess. Hey, there he is. There you are, rival. What you doing? Hi, Nam. Who's asking? You're pretty uppity for a talking beast. One thinks you're a beast. Don't mix me up with those monsters. Wanna get cursed? <laughs> is that a threat? Hey, do something about her. She's your pet, right? No, she's my friend. <laughs> Bad attitude, huh? Yeah. I'm pretty much stuck with her too. Oh, Kahu, she can hear you. Bet you'd be real sad without me. I'd be real sad if I I'd like you, Nico. Are you looking for that orb thing too? That's yep. right. We're rivals. I'm Kahu. Pleased to meet you. You mean I mean I am gonna die without it, but hey. Don't flatter yourself. Get in my way and you'll get hurt. Well, aren't you Kaki? I am. Anybody who don't know me got their head in the sand. <laughs> Uh, you're kind of a jerk. Kind of don't like you. Let's talk hey, some more. Hey, Nam, you really that strong? Want to hear my record and quake in your boots? 40 wins out of 41 lifetime. Take well, me. Tomahawk Nam. It's kind of a lame name. Tomahawk? How stupid. You made that up yourself. <laughs> Nico. I said they call me. You're starting to tick me off. Forget that. That old man, he's the one who ruined my perfect record. Never forgive him. So yeah, arrogant, powerful guy who gets his record broken. Gets all pissy about it. Don't like you, Nam. You're kind of annoying. Not really. The fire The fire one It's not really one of my favorite more favorite characters. Here's another coup, by the way. This is a more physical attacking coup. This one's interesting. I like this coup. It's, uh, it's pretty cool. Ha 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 ha. May as well heal a scooter because of uh, stuff. But basically, it uses a move called Blast Chance. What it does basically is it does more damage if it crits. So it has like super crits, which is kind of cool. So uh, basically, yeah, its crits hurt. Uh, it did a pretty decent amount of damage. I mean, Tamal's probably arguably my tankiest person at the moment. Um, okay, I th he should be able to live. Live this hit, please. Or you can just crit and kill him. That's cool too, Tamal. It's not like stealing ever needs experience. Ceiling gets no love. The thing is, I want to make sure I want to make sure little food can catch up quickly enough. So, I guess next time I fight small, I'll give Ceiling the experience though, because I don't want him to fall behind either. That's kind of annoying, honestly. Ah, yeah. excuse me, but I shall demonstrate the strength of Uggs. Um, sounds like about? fun. Fighting is the best way to have you understand strength. Let's go. Well, it looks like I'm stuck in the middle of a battle. So, time to battle this guy. Should be relatively easy. Okay, let's all go. Hey, okay, let's go. 
Yeah, um, let's, let's do it. Okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead, go into Wind Saga since we know it's pretty potent. I don't know why we're killing this guy, but that's fine. You you do that. Uh, burn Shadow Herd. They're definitely getting a little bit low on health, but I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, go for this one more time just to sort of I tap my mic accidentally. But I'm just gonna use this as an opportunity to just wipe this guy out pretty fast, and then we're gonna switch into Scooter to heal up and. What is this guy going to do? I don't not like these guys, by the way. These guys are evil, but uh, this one's not doing the horrible attack. He has a really nasty attack, um, where the, the, the one, of these, one of these versions of the monsters has a really nasty attack that I do not like to deal with. So uh, we might come across that at some point, but it's it's not pleasant. So probably next episode, because I'm probably ima I imagine I'm going to end this. Uh, at the end of this area, kind of like I did with the Earth one. That seems like it would be a relatively good plan, but this guy's already dead. I mean, we're definitely going through these a lot faster Such now. A disgrace. Yes, you are. We haven't got any Kalma yet, though. That's kind of worrisome. I definitely want to get some Kalma, at least. There we go. Good levels, finally. Three levels for Fu, and none for t for Scooter, which is kind of unfortunate. So you understand the strength of Ags? Not really. I kind of kicked your ass. But we, oh, a resurrect yes, book. Quite. But are you okay? They risk their lives, the Ogs do. I, I guess so. My way. Um. Sure. We'll go with that. So the hard cognitives will boost Og strength even further, but sadly I don't even have anything to do with this. But resurrect book, uh, resurrects one fallen beast. That's actually really handy. If I lose someone in battle, I can use that to bring them back to life. That is really awesome. Oh, this is, okay, this is one of the key spore, so we already got the key spore. I still haven't found any Kalma, though. There's definitely, like, a good two or three different Kalma I can get here, and I definitely want to get them. Um, including the one that actually, uh, I'm sure there's, I think there's one that has the magic spell, because I don't think that's an early one. Sakabon! Be prepared! No! Uh, we might as well store our Cognance while we're here, because, uh, I don't want to get an item, I want to put an item. What's the Caltrop doing? Bug strengths. I don't need to deal with that right now. Anyways, distractions. Uh, store you, store you, store you, store you. And I don't really need these things either, so. We're not really running into too much problems with uh, inventory, but we will once we have more complicated forests that are much longer. These forests are still relatively short. Um, the later, later, the late games ones are gonna be much longer. There was a guy right there, and I'm gonna have to fight him now, and I have initiative. And I'm not even going to really cut this out, because I'm just going to... I should have gone to Scooter first. That was kind of bad of me not to, but... You lived! And then you got poisoned. And then you didn't. Oops. Oops. But there we go. Level 18 for you. That's good. Probably should have gone to Scooter to get the experience as well, but... Uh, but well, well, hindsight's 20 Hey! The red hot thing I need to get for my quest. That's pretty cool. Uh, well, well, we got a guy here. I may as well, well, he turned around. I may as well fight you and get a little bit of a experience, just because I'm missing out on some. Dead. That was a double crit right there. Tamal is just killing people left and right and center. It's kind of ridiculous. A uh, little food might be getting close to the point where they'll uh, go ahead and evolve, though. So that'd be good. Do we just take your, we just, I guess this force is stuff. We still don't have a single comma yet. Really? We're just, just not going to get any comma this whole time, I guess. Cool. I guess there's going to be a lot for me to do when I come back here after the water forest. Well, that's annoying. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and end the episode, I guess, at this point. So uh, this is Lucky7DX signing out. In the next episode, we're going to take on the boss of Fire Spy and probably start the water level as well. So uh, I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.